first. Terry Hatcher and James Denton eating up the ballpark. The desperate housewife takes to the diamond, making the first pitch for her co-star's baseball team. There's a base hit up the the sexy plumber is one of the new owners of the minor league Orange County Flyers, even though the seven-figure price tag was a bit of a budget buster. I couldn't pass it up, even though I really couldn't afford it. My <laughs> wife was a really good sport. His wife and kids are big supporters, along with his TV wife, Terry. When you found out that he was buying the team, what did you think? Well, I wasn't surprised, because the entire first season of Desperate Housewives, I used to tease him that the only reason he was doing the show was so he could throw the first pitch. Act like I'm a baseball player. Terry warmed up and tossed okay, ball okay. after ball, trying to throw some heat. But Denton wasn't finished. It's breaking news right now. She does, she's not aware of this, but you're also singing the national anthem. <laughs> so, uh, Come in, so stick, so stick around. Right stick now. around for that, will you? <laughs> That's worse. That I'm not <laughs> doing. But we do have some other breaking news about the new season of Desperate Housewives premiering September 30th on ABC. Show creator Mark Cherry says perhaps a baby boo? L little one on Wisteria Lane? There could be a baby arriving on Wisteria Lane sometime soon. Possibly two. Twins or two people having babies? I'm not going to tell you. But what about the fate of Nicolette Sheridan's character? All right, you left us with a big cliffhanger at the end of last season. I left you hanging. We, we're dying to know. Is, is Edie alive? Uh, all questions about that will be answered in the first episode. And let me just say that uh, Nicolette Sheridan makes some kind of appearance, and it won't be in the way you might think. Okay, and expect new neighbors, including soap star Tuck Watkins and judging Amy's Kevin Rom. They'll play a gay couple.